this guy's oblivious, doesn't even look over at me. I honk and he's just like thinking he's getting honked out to move forward. It's like, no, we're, we're honking at you to have a conversation about the future currency here, sir, Kryptonic. We got March 26, 2021 here. Another beautiful day at our backs as you're about to see once these shadows go away, which they have now. Wow, birds flying, chirping, going all sorts of directions. Through the air that I breathe to survive, they used to take flight and lift. Gravity holds us down. Welcome to episode 11. What the Bitcoin? Hey Austin, what do you think of Bitcoin? Uh, I wish I would have hopped on the train when it happened. Do you think it's too late? It's already left the station? No, actually, I, uh, yesterday we hit a big dip in it. I do have some money invested in it. Oh! Um, we're hopeful that it'll go back up, as everybody else is. Yeah! So Austin, uh, initially it seemed like you were not invested at all, but you have vestments there. Yeah. You just wish that it would have come a bit earlier. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. I, I fell into some money at one point. Um, wasn't thinking about Bitcoin too much, and that would have been a easy path to being a millionaire, as okay. many other people have become one. So. Yeah. Um, like I said, it's it's not too late. It's. Uh, it's the future of money. Okay, so you think it's the future? Yeah. Okay. And Austin, is there any chance that Bitcoin and cryptocurrency and blockchain, the influence of that, any chance it's God? No. I okay. Don't think so. No. No. And I mean that on the parameter that it is being disruptive and it's waking a lot of people up to the institutionalized fiat currencies yeah. that we're all in governed and imprisoned by. Yeah. The the disruption of it could be God. Yes. Yeah. Okay, to form that a bit better. Yeah, and that's okay. Um, I do understand that in that way. So, um, yeah, it's changing a lot of people's thoughts about a lot of different things and money in general. Money rules the world, and this is a new type of money that people don't really have any idea of how it works. And, um, you know, the people that are figuring out how it works, it's um, they're very promised in cryptocurrency so yeah yeah and do you have any other investments or is it just bitcoin um ethereum as well it's it's going up there and we're gonna see some pretty big things from ethereum as well soon hey do you own bitcoin blue be easy on them good afternoon man my name is joshua your name tay tay yes. nice to meet you man How's your day going it's going really good going really good hey tay i'm happy to hear that tay what do you think about bitcoin i don't know too much about bitcoin have you, you've heard of it though? Yeah, I heard of it. Yeah. Okay, where'd you hear about it from? Just the uh, internet. The internet through like news or? Yeah. Okay, and then do any friends talk about it as well? Uh, nah, no, nah, no. Nah. No, and then Tay, any plans to invest in the future at all? Definitely. Okay, and then based on the slight knowledge and what you know about Bitcoin, do you think that that's influenced by God in any way? Uh, honestly, I'm not even sure, man. Okay. Nathan, do you own Bitcoin, Nathan? Huh? Do you own Bitcoin? No, I do not. You don't? Do you think anything of it? Not really. He didn't get too many questions, but he said it was his grandfather's ride. Still riding good. I can appreciate that style, Nathan. Thank you, man. What's up, guys? Welcome to Josh Q's channel. If you guys don't mind, drop a like, comment, and subscribe. And shout out to Josh Q and all his vlogs, friends, and family. Can't really see anything up there. That's kind of the way of 45 though, and Houston in general. I'm trying to see if we can't get a traffic interview about Bitcoin. We're backed up. I'm trying to get some interviews here. <laughs> this guy's oblivious, doesn't even look over at me. I honked and he's just like thinking he's getting honked out to move forward. It's like, no, we're, we're honking at you to have a conversation about the future currency here, sir, Kryptonic. No one, everyone's asleep at two o'clock in Houston, man. Let's try and get this guy all state belting. Hey, I film a documentary. Can I ask you guys a couple questions real quick? No, this is delaying it. It's screwing me, man. <laughs> Thank you guys. <laughs> oh, they said no. That's all right. We'll get somebody else. They're like, ah, get some footage here. 
they're all weirded out by it, you know. Might not be the move to try and get. Damn it, I was trying to get this guy to let me interview him, not that I was gonna let him over in traffic. He looked at the perfect person to interview about Bitcoin as well. He's really telling me thank you. You know, I might just do something illegal here real quick. We're gonna try and get an interview real fast. Hey, I film a documentary, man. Can I ask you a couple questions real quick? Okay. Hey, what are you, what's your name? David. David, what do you think about Bitcoin, David? I don't know much. Don't know much? No. When did you first hear about it? You know, four years ago. Four years ago. Is that right? Yeah, I mean, well, it's been around for a bit, but uh, four years is in, in line with the general adoption. Yeah. Any plans to buy it after we talk today? Uh, yeah, I mean, I've got some plans, but it's kind of high, isn't it? Yeah, but uh, maybe it keeps going, right? So I do some research. Okay. Ask your friends that are invested. Okay. David, I'm going to cut in front of you, okay? Sure, Thank ahead. you so much, man. It's been Joshua, okay? Yeah. yeah. Football player, I knew it and invested into that, you know, and, and, and it was supposed to have been uh, very good for being able to make some money off of it. Yeah. But uh, I don't know how he come out in it after he put so much money into Bitcoins, uh, trying to see uh, which way would this money go because uh, the banks are no good. And a person have to be able to find something to invest in to even hold on to your money. Exactly right, yeah. You don't, what you got will get away from you. Yes. And you go in these banks, they charge you for fees, for checking, and, and fees for account, and, 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 and you write a check as fee, you look around, all your money gone. Yeah. Then ate up in interest. Yep. Timothy, do you think there's chance that Bitcoin is an intervention by God? I don't know about that. I have to see how it's gonna come out. I hadn't done enough research to elaborate on that. Yeah. The only thing I learned, I saw it, and I read up an article on it, but I never did follow it up. Yeah. This must have been about last week. You know, I was just reading an article they had out. Yeah, Jonathan, yeah. Okay. About Bitcoin. Yeah. But uh, I just I just started thinking because uh, it's money in coins. Yeah. You know, but you have to know what to get into to keep from losing. I know the speed limit says 40, but I'm not going to touch over 30. We got us a rotisserie chicken in the back. I don't typically drink these things, but I just felt like getting a little high school tonight. A little frolicky, finicky. Might be even give me some a little, a little bit of anxiety. A uh, lesson I learned yesterday from Timothy. Anything that's anxious for you, anxious for nothing, find yourself in God, or at least in something purposeful, faith-driven, forward. Thank you, Timothy. I thank you. Because me? he had this day predestined. And that way I can give you some strength. I give you some power. Put some power in your nasty behind. It ain't about that. It's getting the closer to God so you can do what you need to do. <laughs> you know, guys, that was episode 11 of What the Bitcoin. I was watching this gentleman filming him with the, uh, just look at the effort here. Imagine if I had to film with this, folks, cut together the footage with, with scissors and tape to try and even attempt to bring you guys these daily videos. Wow, the digital age, digital age that we live in that allows me to communicate with you folks daily about how the world is taking this new emerging financial market and the perceptions that are shifting with it. I look forward to bringing you episode 12 tomorrow. Until then, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe, as well as share this to, like, everyone. Thank you.